I mean, so I have a question actually. It's a um, uh, very uh, normally asked question, and I'm asking on behalf of everyone um, that when a woman, um, a, a wife, a wife of the house, she's renting the house, and randomly the husband came in, and he's not praying there behind her. Um, maybe she's praying, um, you know, Nawafe, Sunnah, maybe for we don't know. But I'm assuming for sure he's praying. Yeah, so, so, what is sister that? Atia, pardon me. Yeah. Uh, your voice is breaking off. I wasn't able to comprehend your question. Can you start over? Yeah, sure, sure. So I'm asking uh, for a housewife who is praying already in the room, and then husband randomly came in and he started behind her, not exactly behind. Can you hear me, please? I hear you yes, now. Sir. You said a woman was praying in the room and the husband decided to offer whatever prayer. They're not related to each other. He happened to be, yes. be not exactly behind her, but you yes. know, technically he's in the second row. Isn't this your question? Yeah, kind of, yes. Okay. The answer is, number one, they are not in the same prayer. Number two, she's not leading the prayer. Number three, that is his wife. Number four, he's not exactly behind her. So he's taken aside. This is permissible. What is not permissible if a woman is taking the lead, leading the prayer, or if a man is praying right behind a woman. This is not permissible. Okay? Right. Sure. So right behind is the thing we need to avoid all the time. Exactly. Okay. Like, if, like if I have a designated area in my flat where we call it musalla, so I started my prayer and my wife actually praying her own prayer next to me, her own prayer independently. Is this valid? It's valid. But if we decide to pray jama'ah, so she would have to pray behind. This is a setup in Sharia. Thank you, Atya from Canada. Do